Hi everyone, welcome to Crochet for Life. In this video, I'm gonna share with you how to crochet this matching hat for this poncho. It's really easy to make, only two rounds to repeat. I'm gonna give you all details step by step. I hope you will love this video. If you like this video, please thumbs up and share and comment down below. If you're new for my channel, don't forget to join with my thousand of subscribers by clicking the subscribe button and the bell icon. Okay, before we start the tutorial, let's see what size I'm going to give you in this video. I'm going to give you three different sizes with this same pattern. I'm going to give you six years plus, eight years plus and the adult size. This pattern is so beautiful and really easy to make. Only two rounds to repeat. I'm going to give you all detail step by step. Even beginners can make two. I really love this pattern with this matching set. In my previous video, I show how to make this matching poncho. If you missed that, I give you a link in the description down below. This poncho is so soft and so comfortable. It's coming beautiful finishing. I really love this matching set. I hope you will love too. This hat size is the 8 years plus. I'm gonna give you adult size with the 6 years plus. You can use the two color, any two color, dark color with the matching light color. I'm using this dark brown with the matching light color. This yarn is the double knitting yarn. This yarn will have 100 gram, 300 meters. This yarn recommend hook is 4 millimeter crochet hook. We need around 50 gram each color. But I'm gonna use 3.5 millimeter crochet hook to make the 8 years plus. If you want to make the adult size, you can use the 4 mm crochet hook with the same number of stitch. Start with the dark color. I'm going to left this much yarn to join this first round. I'm going to start with the dark color. To begin, slip knot and the chain 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. I need altogether 96 chain. Now I have a 96 chain. This 96 chain for the 8 years plus. 96 chain with the 4 millimeter crochet hook for the adult. This pattern is going multiple of 6 plus 2. I'm gonna add 2 more chain. Now I have altogether 98 chain. If you want to make the 6 years plus, you need 90 chain plus 2 chain, altogether 92 chain. This 98 chain is coming 52 centimeter or 20 and half inches. Adult size, make with the same number of stitch with the 4 mm crochet hook. I'm going to start the first row. Turn this chain to the back side using this back loop. When you use the back loop, you can see you can get the beautiful finishing for this hat. I skip first 3 chain. 1, 2, 3. Into the 4th chain. I skip first 3 chain into the fourth chain one double crochet i'm going to count this first three chain first double crochet this the second double crochet into the next chain using back loop one double crochet again into the next chain using back loop one double crochet Again into the next chain, one double crochet. You can see when you use the back loop, it's coming like this beautiful finishing. Continue this pattern into each chain, one double crochet, all around to this first row. I'm going to show you end of this first row. Now I'm nearly finished this first row. I made into each chain using back loop, one double crochet into this last chain. One double crochet. Now I finish this first row. When you finish the first row, it's look like this. 
Now I have all together. I'm going to count this first three chain for the first double crochet. One, two, three, four, five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty, thirty-five, forty, forty-five, fifty, fifty-five, sixty, sixty-five. 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96. Altogether 96 double crochet. Next I'm going to join this first and last double crochet together. Go through this first double crochet go to this first double crochet top and slip stitch I'm going to start second round with the three chain this three chain is going to the second round next I'm using needle to join this first and last double crochet if you want to make the adult size you need 96 double crochet with the 4 millimeter crochet hook if you want to make the 6 years plus you need altogether 90 double crochet with a 3.5 millimeter crochet hook you can hide this yarn tail when you finish this hat next I'm going to start round 2 this first three chain I'm going to count first double crochet for the round two. Don't worry about this size. When you make the round two, it's getting a little bit smaller like this. I'm using front force and back force double crochet for the next round two. Into the first round, this first double crochet, front force double crochet. Into this first double crochet, front force double crochet. This first three chain is going to the back force into the next double crochet back force double crochet again into the next double crochet front force double crochet into the next back force double crochet again into the next double crochet front force double crochet into the next back force double crochet this round two is going one front force double crochet into the next back force double crochet continue this pattern front force and back force double crochet all around this round two i'm going to show you end of this round two now i'm nearly finished this round two front force and back force double crochet into each double crochet into this last double crochet front force double crochet join with this first three chain using slip stitch this first three chain is going to the back force double crochet now i finished round two you can see it's coming a little bit smaller than first round next i'm going to start round three now i finished two round round three start with the chain three one two three this is the first double crochet for the round three into this front force double crochet front force double crochet into this back force double crochet back force double crochet again into the front force double crochet to front force double crochet into the back force double crochet to back force double crochet you can continue this pattern all around to this round three into the front force double crochet to front force double crochet back force double crochet to back force double crochet continue this pattern all around to this round three i'm going to show you end of this round three now i'm nearly finished this round three into the front force double crochet to front force double crochet into the back force double crochet to back force double crochet into this last front force double crochet to front force double crochet 
join with the first third chain using slip stitch now i finished three round i gonna make one more round round four round four start with the chain three one two three again into the front force double crochet to front force double crochet into the back force double crochet to back force double crochet again front force double crochet to front force double crochet back force double crochet to back force double crochet continue this pattern all around to this round four i am going to show you end of this round four now i am nearly finished this round four I made into each front force double crochet to front force double crochet back force double crochet to back force double crochet into this last front force double crochet to front force double crochet go through this first third chain join with the slip stitch now I finished this first four round this four round for the this hat ribbon Next, I'm going to count this pattern round one. This is the pattern for this hat. I'm going to count this pattern with the round one. This first four round for the this ribbon for this hat. Next, I'm going to start round one. Go through this front force double crochet. Hold this dark color yarn to the back. I'm gonna join this light color now you don't want to cut this dark color pull this yarn through this loop now I have a light color on my hook start with the chain one this is the first round for this pattern I made this stitch to one chain next skip two stitch one two into the third stitch skip two stitch into the third stitch double crochet again into the same stitch one double crochet now i have a two double crochet into the same space one double crochet now I have a three four double crochet five double crochet six double crochet and the seven double crochet this is the first shell I have one two three four five six seven double crochet next skip next two stitch into the third stitch skip two stitch into the third stitch single crochet again skip next two stitch into the third stitch skip two stitch into the third stitch seven double crochet one two three four five six and the seven double crochet skip next two stitch skip one two into the third stitch single crochet now you can see I have a two shell this pattern going same way skip two stitch one two into the third stitch seven double crochet one two three four five six seven double crochet skip next two stitch into the third stitch single crochet continue this pattern all around to this round one seven double crochet single crochet seven double crochet single crochet i'm going to show you end of this first round 
now I am nearly finished this first round 7 double crochet skip 2 stitch into the third stitch single crochet skip 2 stitch into the third stitch 7 double crochet 1 2 3 4 5 6 and the 7 double crochet skip next 2 stitch into this chain 1 stitch single crochet now I finish this first round let's see how many shell I have for this first round 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 shell. This 16 shell for the 8 years plus and the adult size. Next, I'm going to start round 2. Go through this chain, first chain space, and pull this dark color. This is the round 2. If you want to make the 6 years plus, you need 15 shell. For the first round round two start with the chain four one two three four into this single crochet one double crochet this is the first V stitch for the round two next chain five one two three four five Skip this 7 double crochet into this single crochet. 1 double crochet. Chain 1. Into the same space 1 more double crochet. This is the second V stitch. Again chain 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Into the next single crochet third V stitch is coming double crochet chain one double crochet now you can see I have a three V stitch this round two is going chain five V stitch into the single crochet continue this pattern all the way around to this round two now I'm nearly finished this round two double crochet chain 1 double crochet into the single crochet chain 5 skip 7 double crochet into the next single crochet double crochet chain 1 into the same space double crochet chain 5 this is the first V stitch start with the 4 chain go through the third chain 1, 2, 3, go through the third chain, slip stitch. Now I finish second round. You can see when you finish the second round, you need 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 V stitch. Next round 3. Round 3, I'm going to start with the light color. You don't want to cut this each round to this yarn. Hold this dark color to the back side now, like this, and pull this light color through this chain space. Now I have a both color loop on the hook. Go through this both color and make one chain. Again, two more chain. Now I have altogether three chain. This three chain I'm gonna count first double crochet for this shell. Into this chain space, one double crochet. Now I have a one, two double crochet. Again into the same space, three double crochet, four double crochet. 5 double crochet, 6 double crochet, and the 7 double crochet. 
this is the first shell for the round 3 I have a 7 double crochet next I gonna anchor this chain 5 I'm using single crochet to anchor this chain 5 using previous shell 1 2 3 4 this is the fourth middle double crochet go through this fourth double crochet anchor this chain 5 using by single crochet you can see again into the next chain space into this V stitch 7 double crochet 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 double crochet anchor this chain 5 using this middle double crochet for the previous shell using by previous shell you can see I have a 2 shell for the round 3 again into this chain space 7 double crochet 1 sorry 1 2 3 4 5 6 and a 7 double crochet again anchor this chain 5 using this previous shell using this fourth double crochet go through this fourth double crochet make sure you have to anchor this chain 5 using by single crochet this round 3 is going into each V stitch 7 double crochet continue this pattern all around to this round 3 I'm gonna show you end of this round 3 now I'm nearly finished this round 3 single crochet into this V stitch 7 double crochet 1 2 3 4 5 6 and the 7 double crochet go through this 4 double crochet top anchor this chain 5 using by single crochet go through this first third chain slip stitch now I have finished round 3 I have again round 3 16 double sorry 16 shell next I am going to start round 4 round 4 start with the again dark color I am going to pull this dark color through this loop now I have a dark color on my hook start with the chain 4 1 2 3 4 into this single crochet double crochet that's the first V stitch for the round 4 again chain 5 1 2 3 4 5 skip this shell into this single crochet second V stitch coming with a double crochet chain 1 double crochet again chain 5 1 2 3 4 5 into the next single crochet V stitch double crochet chain 1 double crochet continue this V stitch into each single crochet to this round 4 I'm going to show you end of this round 4 now I am nearly finished this round 4. I made into each single crochet to 1 V stitch. Chain 5, 2, 3, 4, 5. Here I have a 4 chain. Go through the 3rd chain 1, 2, 3. Make the slip stitch. Now I have finished round 4. Again I have a 16 V stitch. Next I am going to use light color pull this light color through this V stitch 
is the round 5. Go through this both loop, make one chain. Need more two more chain. Now I have a three chain. Make sure when you use the shell stitch, use this yarn to the this side. Then you can get the beautiful finishing for this hat. You can see. We need seven double crochet into each V stitch. Now I have a three, four, five, six, and a seven double crochet. You can see this coming beautiful finishing on the back side. Again, after seven double crochet. Using the previous shell top, anchor this chain 5 using by single crochet. This is the first shell, it's the third round first shell. This start is going to the side, don't worry. You can get the beautiful finishing when you finish this hat. Again into the next V stitch, 7 double crochet. This round is going into each V stitch, 7 double crochet. Continue this pattern all around to this round 5. Into each V stitch, 7 double crochet. Anchor this chain 5 using by single crochet. Continue this pattern all around to this round 5. I am going to show you end of this round 5. Now I am nearly finished this round 5. I made into each V stitch 7 double crochet, anchor this chain 5 using by single crochet, go through this first third chain, slip stitch. Now you can see I am finished round 5. Again when you finish the round 5, you need 16 shell. Now I finish 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. This only 2 rounds to repeat, round 2 and round 3 is the repeat round. Continue this pattern to your hat size. Now I am nearly finished this round 15 for this hat. 7 double crochet. Anchor this chain 5 using by single crochet. Go through the first third chain slip stitch. Now you can see I am finished 1 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 round. After 15 round you can see I have a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 shell round. This size for the 8 years plus or adult size with the 4 millimeter crochet hook. 6 years plus 13 round. Next I am going to decrease the stitch. I am using dark color round 16. Round 16 I am going to decrease. Start with the chain 4. This last 7 round is same for the 6 years plus as well. Start with the chain 4. Into the single crochet. Double crochet. This is the first V stitch. After 15 round we make the this each round I we made the chain 5. Now I am going to make 4 chain after we stitch. 1, 2, 3, 4. Chain 4. Into the next single crochet. We stitch. It's coming with a double crochet. Chain 1. Double crochet. Again. Chain 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, into the next single crochet, V stitch, double crochet, chain 1, double crochet. You can see this between these two V stitch is coming 4 chain, 1, 2, 3, 4, into the next single crochet, Double crochet, 
chain 1 double crochet continue this round 16 with the chain 4 I'm going to show you end of this round 16 now I nearly finished this round 16 I made V stitch chain 4 go through this first third chain slip stitch Now you can see it's coming little bit smaller. Next round, I'm going to round 17. I'm going to start with the light color. Pull this yarn and make the chain one, two more chain, altogether three chain. Pull this dark color and tie this yarn into this V stitch, double crochet. This first three chain is the first double crochet. Now I have a one, two double crochet, three double crochet, four double crochet, and a five double crochet. You can see one, two, three, four, five. Five double crochet. This is the previous shell. Have a seven double crochet go through the four double crochet anchor this chain four using by single crochet again into the next V stitch its shell is coming with the five double crochet one two three four and five five double crochet anchor this chain four using by single crochet again into the next V stitch is coming five double crochet shell one two three four and a five double crochet anchor this chain four using by single crochet continue this round 17 into each V stitch five double crochet now I'm nearly finished this round 17. I made into each V stitch 5 double crochet cell 3, 4, and 5 double crochet. Anchor this chain 4 using by single crochet. Go through this first third chain and the slip stitch. Now you can see it's coming a little bit smaller. Next, how we gonna use the dark color? This the round 18. Start with the chain four. One, two, three, four. Into this single crochet, one double crochet. This the first V stitch. This time we're going to reduce again the chain. Here I have a four, five, four. Next I'm going to make the two chain. One, two. Into the next single crochet. Skip this five double crochet into the next single crochet. Next V stitch is coming with the double crochet. Chain one, double crochet. Again, chain two, one, two, into the next single crochet. V stitch, double crochet, chain one, double crochet. This round 18 is going V stitch into single crochet separate by the chain two. Now I'm nearly finished this round 18. V stitch, chain 2, go through this third chain, this is the four, first four chain, go through the first third chain, slip stitch. Now I am going to cut this dark color, we don't want any more this dark color, tie this dark color using not now you can see it's come in reduce the stitch this the round 19 round 19 
start with the chain one two three this is the first double crochet into this chain space one double crochet now I have a one two double crochet again one more double crochet now I have a three double crochet one two three next you can see this is the previous shell have a one two three four five double crochet go through the third double crochet top anchor this chain two using by single crochet again into the next V stitch I'm gonna make three double crochet one two and three double crochet anchor this chain 2 using this third double crochet top using by single crochet again into the next V stitch 3 double crochet this round 19 is going into each V stitch 3 double crochet anchor this chain 2 using by single crochet continue this round 19 all around to this round I'm gonna show you end of this round 19 now I am nearly finished this round 19. I made into each V stitch 3 double crochet. Anchor this chain 2 using by single crochet. Again into the next V stitch 3 double crochet. Anchor this chain 2 using by single crochet. Now I am finished round 19. Go through the first third chain slip stitch. Now you can see we need to close this big hole using three more rounds. I'm gonna make all together now. We have a 16 shell. Start with the chain 2. This is the round 20. Chain 2. Into the next double crochet. Double crochet, last loop on a hook. Now you can see I have a two loops on a hook again next to the next double crochet double crochet last loop on a hook go through this three loops make one stitch again into the next shell here I have a three double crochet make the three double crochet last loop on a hook one two three Now I have a three loops with the all together four loops. Go through this all loop, make one stitch. Again, into the next three double crochet to make one stitch. Go through this double crochet, last loop on a hook, double crochet, last loop on a hook, double crochet, last loop on a hook. Go through this fourth loop make one stitch continue this round 20 now you can see I have a three stitch continue this round 20 now I'm nearly finished this round 20 three stitch together again three double crochet last loop on a hook one two three go through this all loop make one stitch this is the first stitch go through this first stitch make the slip stitch round 20 finish with the 16 stitch you can see I have a 16 stitch 6 years plus you need 15 stitch Next, I'm gonna make round 21. Round 21, start with the chain 1. I'm gonna make into each stitch one single crochet. One single crochet. Two single crochet. Three single crochet. 
four single crochet five single crochet six single crochet seven single crochet eight single crochet nine single crochet ten single crochet eleven single crochet twelve single crochet thirteen single crochet fourteen single crochet fifteen single crochet sixteen single crochet six years plus you need fifteen single crochet for this round next i gonna start round twenty two this round twenty two is going to stitch together start with the chain one go through this single crochet and keep this loop on a hook go through the next single crochet now i have a three loops on a hook make the one stitch again two single crochet together now i have a two stitch again two stitch together three Four, five, six, seven. stitch together this is the last two stitch eight stitch go through this first stitch make the slip stitch now I can cut this yarn this is the last round We have a 16 we 16 shell then we have finished with the 8 stitch you can see next we can close this hole using needle this last seven round is same for the six years plus as well I'm using needle to close this hole if you want you can use same like this after closing this hole or you can use the pom pom to this hat top pass the needle through this each stitch like this then you can close this hole is nicely I'm going to give you this same hat with the baby size and the toddler size. It's a different stitch for the small size. Pull this yarn, then you can close this hole like this. Next, you can use the knot to close this stitch. 
now I'm done this hat you can use the pom pom or you can use like same like this I'm gonna use this dark color pom pom for this top it's coming beautiful finishing I'm using seven centimeter size pom pom maker to make this pom pom this is the seven centimeter size I'm finished this poncho with the dark color then I'm gonna use this same dark color to this pom pom from now follow this video when you finish this set don't forget to share with me in our Facebook group I give you link in the description down below Pull this both yarn tail to inside the hat and tie this pom pom. Next, you can pull this both yarn tail to the outside and cut the same size as the pom pom. You can use this hat with the pom pom or without pom pom. I like this hat with the pom pom. It's coming beautiful finishing. I really love this set with the hat with the po poncho. I'm gonna give the same pattern with the toddler size. I hope you will love this set. If you like this video, please thumbs up and share and comment down below. I really love this set. I hope you enjoy too. If you like this video, please thumbs up and share and comment down below. See you again with another video.